Hello, this will be a quick movie review of The Last Airbender. I won't be getting into close detail and breaking down this movie, just some key points I would like to address. If you've never seen or heard of the television show before you see this movie, I suggest you see the TV show first in its entirety before you attempt to see this movie. Fans of the show, be warned. This movie butchers the show till there is nothing left. Stay away if you can to preserve the way you portray Avatar. They mispronounce almost every character's name. Every time you hear someone call Aang Ung, you're going to feel like you're sinking deeper and deeper into your seat every time they say it. Avatar Roku does not make an appearance, only his dragon does, and speaks to Aang uh, by himself. You get to see a statue of Avatar Roku, but that's about it. There are no Kyoshi Warriors and no Suki in this entire film, no City of Omashu and no King Bumi. No John John, Aang's first firebending teacher. Aang seems to already know how to use his avatar state, which is kind of odd. The actors, except for Uncle Iroh and Princess Yue, are horrible, too robotic and emotionless. Felt like these people were just reading from a script. The camera work was awful. One time the camera was so close to Aang's face you feel like you're up his nose. Also, there was far too much slow motion. Really took away the intensity of the fighting. Made it boring to watch. The movie as a whole felt way too rushed and fast-paced. It felt like the scenes were just whizzing by, and if you weren't keeping up, you could get lost easily if you are not, uh, if you are new to the story. If you got up to go to the bathroom, forget it. Just don't come back at that point. The film also felt very B-movie-ish, mainly because of the shallow acting and the poor camera work. The only positive things about this movie was the special effects and the fight choreography. Very fun to watch, but. Uh, it gets ruined by how fast the scenes are changing. In all, this movie is on par with the Dragon Ball Evolution film, as both are the butchery of source material and aren't even good movies by themselves. They just suck. Stay away and enjoy the television show. It, it's still and will continue to be a masterpiece.